what's going on guys welcome to drake hollow drake hollow just released on pc xbox game pass and you could have purchased it a few days ago or maybe even a couple weeks ago on xbox itself the best way to describe this game if you're not familiar is kind of like scrap mechanic survival uh pretty much you run around gather explore survive eat sleep that type of stuff and you build a base in a centralized location to defend this special crystal and that special crystal gets attacked by a whole bunch of mean little plants and these mean little plants are called ferals and those ferals are out to take the crystal and obviously you build your base to defend against the crystals with traps weapons and a bunch of other cool upgrades of course i'm going to be joined by crystallish and i am boomer today this is going to be a first hour unedited gameplay but in the future these videos will be edited if you guys want to get the unedited version similar to this video go ahead and become a two dollar member or more down below second i don't want to talk too much in the beginning but we are going to be doing a giveaway for this game uh one or more copies i have one right now but we might get more all you have to do is comment down below what you're looking forward to most in drake hollow and a way to contact you either instagram at or twitter at or your discord name with hashtag that's all you got to do to enter and i'll be sure to hit one of you up and let you know that you're the winner um in a future episode last but not least again this is going to be posted every single day so subscribe if you're new here and like the video and uh we will be live streaming this occasionally as well so go follow on my twitch and uh let's create a character i want to try to make it look as close to me as possible <laughs> whoa that's some goldie locks i don't know about that this is what i want my hair to look like but it's not quite there yet um that's probably closest i would say because it's just a big messy Oh, no, that. That's probably closest. Let's do that. Eye color. I have like a gray-blue kind of eyeball. There we go. Hair. I have like a red-brown. So we're something like in here. Yeah. And brow color. We also have kind of like a red-brown. There we go. That's me. Time to kill some plants. The anti-vegan simulator. That's what this game is. What do you want, Mr. Bird? Give me the gold medallion. Psst, take it. It talks? What? Birds talk and plants attack you? What in the heck is this universe? Come here, you stupid bird. Give me the gold medallion. I want a gold medallion. I've got a different path for you. Gee, willikers. Do I, do I, can I, no? I can't go through there? What about through, ow, oh, okay, we're good. This way, kid. Don't call me kid. I used to hate that. People in middle school would be like, kid, get over here. I'm not a kid. You're the same freaking age as me. I guess the bird's probably an all-knowing wise bird that can carry a gold medallion, so he's probably a little bit older than me. Hey, it's literally called Wise Crow. Hey, kid, look, I've been sent to find someone, and I think you're it. Oh, of course I'm it. I'm the best. This door I'm sitting on, I'm going to need you to walk through it. It's strictly speaking a normal spooky door in the woods. Really more of a portal. Some folks on the other side could really use your help. I can't force you to step through. You got to do it on your own. I appreciate deciding fast. My brain's getting foggier the longer I'm on this side. Not going to be able to stick around for much longer. I got to warn you, this is could be a one-way trip. No telling when you get back. It's going to be dangerous. So you up for an adventure? Step on in. You know, no, I think I'll just go home. That's fine. <laughs> I'm just kidding. All right, let's go through the gate. Whee! Boop. decision press space bar I'm awake where am I I think this is where I touched the the magical crystal of destiny magical crystal of destiny hello I hear it humming to me magical crystal hello please let me touch you. Can I grab these mushrooms? Oh, blight shrooms. I'm going to go back for these ones. I don't know what they're used for, but they're definitely an item that we're going to require. Maybe it's something we could eat, since this is a survival game. Hello? The humming seems like it's coming from behind me now. Am I going the wrong way? I can't be. There's only one path. Oh, hi, wise bed. Ah, you made it. Much better. Head was fogging up. It was something awful. No offense, but I hate crossing over. If I'm being honest, I wasn't sure you'd cross. I'd be starting to lose hope. It seems like a short supply of everyone these days. Welcome to the hollow. It's seen better days, I'm afraid. That's kind of why you're here. Follow me. I'll clarify. Oh, no. Left shift to sprint. So this is a bit of a tutorial area, it seems like. It's going to teach us kind of about the ins and outs of the game, which is nice. Don't leave me, Mr. Bird. Space to jump, just like 
I like the jumping. It's kind of nice and bouncy, very cartoony. I brought you here in the request of an old friend, someone from the side of the hedge from the way back. Probably the best of you heard from them directly. She left me this note, a note from Sarah Howe. Dear Wise Crow, I know how to help you and the drakes. I need you to find the warrior, strong of will and body, sensitive to animals. Look for them when the hedge is thin. Bring them to finish what I am too frail to accomplish. They must work with the drakes to build their power and seek out the effects, hidden from the Terminator. Find them. It's the only way to save the hollow. Yours, Sarah Howe. Okay. So here we are. You've got the youthful vigor we need. The hedge was thin in the evidence by here conversation, by this here conversation. You got the gift of animal whispering. I wish I had the gift of animal whispering. My dogs won't even look at me, even if I have a treat. Come on, I've got something I'd like you to try. And some folks I think you should meet. Okay. So that's the note right there, right? Okay, so you wrote it on like a piece of bark. Cool, cool, a tire. Can we make a tire swing? I want to push my friends on a tire swing. Ooh, we got a compass now. Hello, wise crow. He's going down. Oh, it's so pretty. Look at that. Whoa, besides the big demon uh, spikies. We call those prickers where I'm from. The normal people call them thorns, but welcome to the Northeast. They're prickers because they prick you. Hi. Hold E to talk to the crow. Now we've had a little nature hike, it's time to get to work. I've got a little theory about you. Want to test it out? See if you really did choose the right person for the job. I think there's more to you than you realize. Best see for yourself. The pile of crystals over there, get up close. Attune your mind on what I'm waking them. See what happens. This is the weird crystal I was talking about I saw in the trailer. But these, these demon prickers are scary. I don't like it. I don't like it one bit. Why is there a balloon a balloon one? Maybe it's a waypoint? Awaken the shrine is the quest. Alright, I'm gonna touch the butt. Touch the butt. Touch the butt. He touched the butt! Oh. There we go. Alright, put the crystal back. What did you do? Oh, the prickers are gone. <gasps> Is that a drake? He's so cute. Oh my god. Oh my god. They're adorable. I will call you Squishy 1 and Squishy 2. Bad Squishy! Get out! Yeah! I'm gonna whack the crap out of that. Gimme, give gimme give the stick. There's a bad Squishy. Where's the stick? Press 1 to equip your melee. Come here. Where's the bad Squishy? Where is he? Huh? Who wants some? There he is. Get your buns over here, bad squish. Multiple bad squishies. Oh, God. Come here. Come here. Beat your, beat, beat your bum. Ow. Oh. Can I, like, dodge? That'd be nice. Okay. Mission accomplished. Talk to the wise crow. Hello, wise crow. I beat all the bad squishies. You've met our esteemed allies, the drakes, and vanquished a pack of pesky feral. Not too bad, kid. The drakes are, com are a companionable lot. Kind souls, unfortunately, they've had a rough go. Ain't what it used to be. Invaders, those terminers, the note mentioned, made a real mess of things. So they're getting real skittish around newcomers with a pendant for brawling. Okay, okay. You're gonna need some legwork to earn their trust. The drakes are plain hungry and thirsty. Hibernating so long, unfortunately, lands no good. Everything that comes from the ground is blighted, inedible. You're going to need to cleanse things for them to eat. You luck of the crafty sort, though. Remember that the attunement business with the crystals? That's right. There's your gift. With a little focus, you can let the drakes know what you need built, and they'll hop to it. Oh, so they'll build for me. Gather up some lumber and build a cleansing cauldron. Check back with me once it's built, and I'll tell you how to use it. Here, take a couple of glowstone shards to get started. You'll need them to build the cauldron. Also, take this healing solve. It's the only one I got. But if you're going to be scrapping with those grunts, you're going to need it. You'll learn how to make more soon enough if you use that one up. Okay, so I got like a healing solve. I got some glowstone shards. There's the healing solve. Uh, I press 3 or hold Q to use it. And we need to chop tree. Do we chop tree with a, with a stick? I don't know if that makes too much sense in this situation. 
All right, well, this is a godly stick, if you ask me. Good gosh. All right, so we got to collect uh, five lumber. All right, it doesn't feel too grindy with the building, which is always nice. I've, ar I've already hit so many trees in my days, you know, I don't need to hit a whole bunch of them all the time. All right, so press C to enter build mode. Okay, so you got Q and E, select structure, E to continue. Okay. I'm not sure, like, where I want to put this, and I don't know if it's going to be permanently there once I join multiplayer, but I'm just going to slap it. Can I, like, rotate this? How do I rotate? Left shift, scroll wheel. Gotcha. Yeah, get out of your hole. Build this cauldron for me. hes I don't know if he's squishy. He's just squishy. They're both squishy, okay? It reminds... You know what? I'm, I'm getting, like, a... Graphically, I'm getting a, uh, a Spore feeling. Music-wise, too, if you guys remember Spore from back in the day. I guess Spore still exists, but you guys... I mean, Spore was a crazy excellent game. I wish they'd create a Spore, too. Okay, I have built the cauldron. What do I do in the cauldron? Do I do things in it? Oh, I probably just mixed foods together to eat, I would assume. Talk to the bed. Nice work, kid. I know you had it in you. Now for the most important part, using the cauldron. You're going to need to investigate the island a bit for a couple things. Juice boxes and bane berries. Bane berries. Uh, get at least four of each. Walk up the cauldron and toss them in. Soon the berries and juice will be cleansed and the drinks can chow down. Knowing they've got a meal waiting should show them you're not looking to do them harm. Okay. So they, they want me to feed the drakes. I think I have all the supplies. Oh, I almost have enough bane berries. I think these are the bane berries. All right. They don't look anything like bane, but they're definitely berries. Um, but where do I find juice boxes? Do I just go look for them? I assume because there's some old, like, old dilapidated houses and stuff up in here. Maybe this is where I found the juice boxes. Can I open this? There we go. Okay. I found a butter churn. Oh, I found a juice box. Where is that? Oh, I don't know even where that was. Oh, it was inside the car. I thought I could break down the car all the way. My bad. Okay. So we got enough juice boxes. Hold. Oh, I have. Is that a nail gun? Hold one to go to your equip menu. Oh. Oh, a coat rod? Oh my god, I'm gonna start mashing some things with coat rods. I have a nail gun to shoot with now. Heck yes, brother. That's cool. Awesome. All right. Um, hold and stock the cauldron. Well, there's me floating to the back left. Let's pretend like that's not happening currently. Also, where I built the cauldron, it made Squishy go inside of uh, where he shouldn't have been. Woodcutter, 30% critical. Oh, so like... Oh. So we're just going to cook a whole bunch of juicy treats for them, and then they're going to upgrade us and... Uh, Malemler. Malemler? Is that his name? His name is Malemler? I hope so. That's an adorable name. Oh, we got food, water, and entertainment. Amount stockpiled. Oh, so you stockpile it for... The, the 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 drakes okay you're making more than you need so you actually have to upkeep your camp <gasps> that's cool oh hi oh so he, they're they're starting to gather some stuff so he is a malemler that's his name malemler and what's your name mepper mepper and malemler i mean those are two adorable names oh and you could depot stuff so that's like a bank if you have too much stuff all right talk to me when can i get my friends in the drakes weren't always like this their hearts are the same, but their minds aren't. Not since the Terminator came along and twisted the magic of this place to their will. With your help, you can restore the Drakes, even send you home once they get their magic back. But before we go off saving the world, we better finish tending to the Drakes' basic needs. The Drakes don't just need food and water. They're going to need a place to sleep. Also, these folks can literally die of boredom. <laughs> oh my gosh. You're proving to be pretty crafty. I think you can help them with the sleeping spots and entertainment. Why don't you try to build the Drakes a couple of thatch beds and poppets? You can get everything you need from thatch beds from trees. As for poppets, look along the shore for cattails. Beat up some cars for some upholstery. All right, can I knock down these giant trees? Question. Oh, 
Leave thatch beds and poppets around to prevent drakes from dying of boredom and exhaustion until you build more permanent structures. Without a place to sleep, a drake will return to hibernation. Make sure there's enough beds or you'll see the population plummet. <gasps> Wait, so we're gonna have a population of them? Like we're gonna have a whole bunch of drakes? It's not just gonna be the one or two, that is? That is awesome. So we're almost like building a town and we're gonna be populating it as we have more things for them and they're gonna gather stuff for us and oh god, oh god, okay. Well, we can't swim. T-I-L. Good to know, good to know. We need some cattails apparently. I'm gonna break some more stuff down. Grab our arrows. Ooh, there's a bow in this game. You guys know. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh, that was a one-hitter quitter. Get the heck out, big boy. It's like an old gas station up there. All right, what do we need for these things, though? Charms can provide magic necessary to produce curios and camp improvements. Interact with drakes to collect charms. Use impact to see how many drake, uh, how many each drake has. Happy drakes produce more charms. And the more drakes in your village, the larger pool you can collect. Okay, that's cool. All right, but as for... Uh furniture we need charms to make thatch beds and we need charms to make that as well but we need more twigs more leaf bundles and more upholstery scrap because they want two of each so i gotta go find some other cars before i head back home but i need these charms or whatever which i'm assuming they just drop maybe i hope Let's try to find one more upholstery scrap. Uh, shoelaces, juice box, none of that. All right, let's go up to this big giant demon mansion on the hill. Don't kill me, don't kill me. I'm assuming that we're going to get into multiplayer after the tutorial. Um, so that's cool. That's fine with me, though. I'm assuming the tutorial will probably end once we get our first, like, invasion. When we first get attacked, because they're supposed to, like, attack your camp. Maybe we're just not quite at that point yet. Um, there's another note here. Huh, okay. Herein lies a full account of the events which plagued the godly folk of our fair town. I, Noel Mason, duly appointed head of the Terminate Court, acted to halt the aggravation of the invisible world upon our populace, and in so doing, encountered witchery most foul. Okay. But I need upholstery scrap. There you go. This is kind of a cool house, though. A lot of boxes in here. Blunderbuss shot, so we can get like a literal shotgun. That's wild. Oops, didn't mean to break your windows. I apologize. Oh, wow, that was so much stuff. I kind of like that the gathering, there's no like crazy inventory. You just kind of break stuff. Makes things a little smoother and easier, in my opinion. Shiny objects. Do you like me a shiny object? Don't get me wrong. All right, seems like that's the loot for here. Works for me, works for me. What's out on the balcony though? Yep, more Home Depot boxes. Gotta get those broken up. Uh, otherwise, I think that's it for this island. All right, nice. Okay, so let's see how we get these charms so we can build for these bad boys. Break this car down real quick. I wonder if these things respawn. They must, right? They're probably You probably just have to explore out further once you start running out of things. I'm assuming the trees respawn, though. All right. I have, like, five messages. How do I open my messages? 20 messages. Active quest. Build beds. Found notes. Help messages. Oh, okay. So that's just in case we missed something or skipped something on accident. Hold the Malemur. Give me y'all charms. I want to hold you. There you go, 15 charms collected. Obtain buff. Thank you. I appreciate it. He just like farted on me. We got 20% added lucky charm drops. I need you. Mepper. Wake up, Mepper! Oh, I can't talk to him while he's asleep. Well, that was good timing then because now I can build them some beds. I'm gonna build them like out here. I know it's horrible because it's like, no, let's put him a little closer. I feel bad, man. I want to snuggle him. I want to snuggle. 
You, you both get your own little cutesy, your own little cutesy little teddy bears. Come on, build them so you can nappy nap. There you go. Get it going, get it going. There it is. Thatch beds provide a place to sleep for one night. Just for one night? That's it? So we need to find some beds that are more permanent or unlock them or something. All right, they got poppets and beds. Snuggle your little teddy bears and... Oh my god! They're so cute! Okay, 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 okay. Wise crow, what now? Tell me what to do. Look at that, you grow up so... They grow up so fast, sniff. So as you've realized, supplies on the island are a bit limited. So about the situation, as you've maybe figured out, you're a little trapped on this island. Fear not, as you're almost likely surmised, this isn't an unfixable situation. Like most problems of the hollow, you can build your way out of this one. Take this schematic. You can use it to unlock ancient and arcane art of building, a curio workshop. Go ahead, try building one. You're going to have to, if you ever want to get out of this place. All right, so that's like another schematic. I can't grab this crystal. Oh, there we go. Epic. All right, so uh, we need to build a curio workshop. Let's go ahead and do that. We unlock it with a schematic. And then we place it right there. And one of these idiots wakes up. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to call you an idiot. You're cute. Wake it up. Build me my curio workshop. And then I have to make an aether wood. Whatever the heck that is. All right. Simple curio workshop. Simple curio workshop is used for R&D <clears throat> of new curios. Useful gadgets and knickknacks. Once you've unlocked a recipe here, you can always make more anywhere from your build menu. Cool. Okay. Um, they want me to do an aether ward. Aether ward. There we go. I crafted aether wards. Build aether wards. Um, I'm unsure of how to build the aether ward. Oh, I already built them. Oh, just talk to the wise crow. Gotcha. Hi, wise crow. That's good feeling I had about that. That good feeling I had about you keeps getting better. I'm sorry to drag you into this, but things have gotten a pretty desperate. There's still drakes out there who need help. Climb the lighthouse up north and take a look-see. Keep an eye out for hibernating drakes along the way and grab any schematics you find. Come back and talk to me once you've explored around there a little bit. This is quite the tutorial, but I'm pretty sure uh, after we get attacked, it should be like, all right, now you're on your own. And when we're on our own, we should be able to invite friends. But this is quite the lengthy tutorial. But I guess there is a lot to this game. If you didn't uh, like, you know, have a tutorial, you'd probably be a bit lost. Okay, I can't go in the water. So how do I get to the lighthouse? I can't go in the water. How do I... Is there a different way? No, that's the way. Um, do I build something? I'm unsure. I have the healing solve. I have the nail gun. How does one get over there? Do I just have to take the damage and make the run? I'm unsure. I don't think I can take the damage. Let's see how much damage it actually does to you. Oh, literally five seconds to run across. Well, that's no good. So we press X and we can like inspect the world. We can like zoom out more. That's cool. Change your field of view so you can see a lot better. But now I'm just curious, how the heck do I get across this thing? It's gonna take more than five seconds to get across, I would assume. Maybe I'm just an idiot. It's gotta be something I can build, right? Let's go back and uh, see if there's something in the workbench we can build. There's gotta be, right? Like a bridge? Or like foundations? Or something like that? I don't really know. Let's go back this way. Investigate the top of the lighthouse. So the top of the lighthouse is gonna have another drake for us. Not to be cute, confused with the six god. But uh, let's see what we can do in here. Simple curio workshop. Aether ward, a profound that perfect, protects against ill effects of aether exposure. Oh. I see. So. 
we need to use that and cross the water is that is that is that what we're gonna do i'm unsure i'm unsure but that's probably what we're gonna have to do right because it protects against aether exposure and they gave us i mean we crafted three of them for the objective so it's probably going to be three to get over there but how are we going to get back if we just don't have enough are we just sol if that's if that's what it is that's what it feels like do we do we just use it drop oh god oh god um get out okay well that didn't work i thought it would protect me it didn't protect me i got a spirit walk to my body this reminds me of like an mmo can we spirit walk through water we can spirit walk through water does this mean we could just cheese our way across i feel like i'm doing something wrong i probably missed something here I thought we had to just like build across, but I don't have anything in my build menu unless I just need to go down like through some different lists or something. Hold E to revive. Boom. Okay, so I made it across, but I did, probably did not do that the proper way by any means. I'll tell you that. I'll wake up the Drake. Look, there's a Drake right here. Oh, hi cutie. Obtain the buff. Health regen? Yeah, sure. Uh, no, I'm gonna keep Lucky. His name is Bipling. That's adorable. So they all have different names. What is this? Give me all of your special things. Oh, we got schematics. Awesome. So we can learn new things. We're at a gas station. Oh. Well, see you later. See ya. You know what? I'm a little curious if we can actually start inviting friends now. Let me look into that for a second. Proceed further into the campaign to enable multiplayer. Okay. I mean, that's what it says, so that's... I'm gonna listen to that. Um... Oh, gosh. I think that's everything here. Can we jump on these and bounce on them like Fortnite? No. Alright, we break down the truck down here. Beautiful, beautiful blunderbuss shot arrows. We got some some evil doers. These are level three ones. There we go. See you later. See you later. So there's the lighthouse. Oh wait. A, so, oh, another rare thing. Five brick. Eleven bricks. Okay. 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 Oop. Cattails. We actually need these for crafting beds and stuff. Okay. So I need to figure out. So we can craft Aether, where it's a, a powerful ward that protects against the ill effects of the Aether. But how do I use them? I feel lost. I can't drag them. I'm a big dummy. There we go. We switch to them with three, and then we hold Q to use. Ah, yes. Okay, epic. Yes, 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 yes. I thought three was to use, but Q is to hold and then three is to swap it over. Gotcha. I, it's coming from a console game to a PC game that you always have to, the controls are always just a little bit more finicky just because they're, they obviously ported this from console, but it'll just take getting some used to. And we'll, we'll get used to it eventually. All right, so we got to get to the top of the lighthouse. See what's popping. Get the top of the lighthouse. Give me your garbage. Thank you. I'm glad that there's uh, not some crazy annoying amount of inventory room. It seems like you can hold 250 items at a time. But like I said, you guys saw there was a bank back at base, so you can drop things off there. Your inventory room starts getting a little cray cray. All right. I hear music, which means lucky drops, right? And I got the 20% lucky drop off that Drakeling that I almost want to keep forever. Let's like get all of these crystals because we're going to need those to cross the Aether. It's actually going to be harder with uh, more people. Because you're going to need a lot more materials to be able to like cross, cross the Aether and stuff together. So difficulty will definitely ramp up when we get the friends on. And what, what the heck? 
gaze? Is this gonna, is this like a, a viewpoint like from Assassin's Creed? That's what it seems like. Maybe it'll give us like waypoints of different locations of Draklings. M to open, open the map. Oh, wow. That's a pretty big map. There's a lot of different islands to explore. Okay. Oh, wait, now what? Bad news, kid. Looks like the activity has caught the eye of the local grunt population. Get back to camp ASAP. This is where the horde comes. Horde night! That's literally what it is. Like I said, it's gonna be... This game's gonna be very similar to Scrap Mechanic in that way. But obviously, this is a game that was built around the survival and the base building and the aspect of hordes attacking your base. So it's gonna run a lot better and be a lot more fun and hopefully a lot less buggy than scrap. Okay, hopefully, I was gonna say, oh, there's no fall damage. Um, but here we go, we're gonna use another Aether tablet. I'm gonna cross this. I'm actually gonna take a second of this to hit this car. Okay, sorry. Just started speaking a different language there. The mumble language of my of my people. All right, and then we'll use another little aether thing. Cross right here. Epic. I bet there's a ton of secrets out there. I bet there's a ton of secrets out in the uh, aether. And if you use a bunch of tablets and run around, I bet you'll find them. Incoming raid. I'm scared. Oh, here it comes. Run, 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 run. I'm almost there. No, stay alive, drinks. We're all good. Quit licking my stuff. Hey. Mm. Bad squishy. Bad. Where are they? Got him. There we go. Oh, we, we got a chest. Oh my gosh, we got... Malkalite shards, bloodstone shards, quote shards. What do you got for me? You have a gift. Give me. Give me, give me. Obtain gift. What do you give me? Oh, thanks. An arrow. You're so cute. Thanks, buddy. We have three of them now. Okay, talk to the crow. You've proven it, no doubt. You've got what it takes. Here's what's going to happen. You're going to rebuild this place. You find a schematic out there? If so, you can use it to get building. Once you build things up, you should catch the terminer's eye, draw them out. You rebuild, take care of the terminer, and that should snap the drakes out of their funk. Get their magic back. Once that happens, they send you home. Simple as that. I warned you, it might be one-way trip, but I think you got this. Here's a little gift to get you started. Fire up this apparition charm if you need to scoot back to camp in a rush. I wonder if this is like a one-time use or if it's like a permanent item. It's a one-time use, it seems like. All right, so build a village, reach camp level four. What do you What do you got to tell me? Look at you building a regular downtown over here. Now it's time you learn something about important of this place. You and the Drakes, everything good that lives here is symbolic. The more mature they get, the more the power will flow to you. Here's what you got to do. Find some crystals out there in the wilderness. Once you find some, you can use them to grow a drake. They can get bigger. Each drake is hungry for a specific type of crystal, so you make sure to match them up. Grow a drake with a crystal. Well, I have a bunch of crystals. So these are like, like, like Firestones and Pokemon. Give him the crystal. Confirm crystals. Eating a drink up means you'll get more health. Their buff will improve and you'll get closer to leveling up your camp. You also need more food, water, entertainment, and camp. Are you ready for that? Well, he's the HP regen guy. What's the one giving me the lucky stuff? He's giving me the lucky stuff. I wish I had a charm for him. I don't want to upgrade his buff. I want to, what's Mepper's buff? Hi, Mepper. Wood cutting increase. Okay, maybe we do want to do the health regen one. Hi, Bipling. All right, we're going to give you a crystal, buddy. Confirm crystal. Quartz shard. Confirm crystals. Select. Quartz shard. Confirm crystals. There you go. Good boy. Are you going to get bigger? No? That's it? All right. Reach level four. Hey, we have multiplayer now. Okay, we're going to convert to multiplayer. And we'll be able to invite friends now. Yay. I'm a crystal. So my drake links are called Malemler. You name them? No, they have names. Malemler, Bipling, and I have Mepper. 
I there's mean... some cute guys so the one of these guys has a 20 percent rare drop buff highly recommend that guy i think that's the one i, I just found the one that gives you extra items yeah 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 Is that it? Yeah, yeah yeah that one yeah. one gives like health regen and the other one does wood cutting so if we need a whole bunch of wood we can talk to that one yeah in mine i had one that had like a higher chance to do critical on the okay feral guys but Wait, i need to had... find the drake now I didn't have to do that. No, no, you don't have to find the Drake. I think you're good now. I, mean that. I think you're good to have multiplayer. You probably are good just to join even once I hit the multiplayer. You probably didn't even need to do it. But if you play single player, I mean, this game's pretty sick. So you can create your own little single player camp. Oh, I don't have beds for him. No. I tried joining. Oh, 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 I got oh. some beds down for him. Oh, there's three of them now. Oh, no. I need a leaf. Hey, boy. I need a leaf bundle. They can't sleep on the cold, hard ground. I feel bad. No, they need toys too. You didn't get them any. Toys. They had toys. They already used the toys. Uh, they okay. already used them. Pick them up. I'm sad. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a greaser. Here. You kind of are. Hey, pony boy. No, you. <laughs> that is me. I am no you. All right, so I am Mel Titty. We need <laughs> we need like we need like walls and stuff. I didn't build any of those. Can I have a a, a, a thingy to hit with? Yeah, yeah. Um, Mel Titty needs one. Here, this is uh this is your your butter churn. <laughs> oh. yeah, dude. All right, let's. Boomer got a butter churn. <laughs> He's gonna butter churn some trees. I'm gonna churn your butter, you don't. All right. Take my wood. Um, my wood. So I'm gonna. How do I even build you walls? My wood. Yeah, you don't. I mean, here, have mine. Take it. I mean. How do I build walls? Uh, that I don't can know. You? Can you? Wait, 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 wait. Curio crafting. Is that a different thing? Is that a thing you have to do? Oh, in wait, your wait, wait, right here. Curio that crafting. Failed. Healing solves apparition charms. I mean, we don't need any of that. Waypoints. Nah. No, 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 no. We need to reach the camp to. level four. There's a way to build walls, man. Do you need, do you have schematics? Can you, do you need to like unlock it? Is there... Gave him some teddy bears. Is there like a skill tree somewhere? Camp? Oh, you need it. schematics, but I'm not sure. Cause I have build improvements one, improvement budget. This would increase the improvement budget two of 10. Can I make any food for them right now? Cause we need some food. Stock up that cauldron. We need some. We need some, some mushrooms. Bears. Find some mushrooms. Going. I'm running. Find some mushrooms. What do you What do you want to tell me, Mr. Bird? So these Terminator Where's I've mentioned, bad dudes. Let me tell you, came here years ago, hundreds of years. Uh, they weren't the first. Obviously, have been last, but then sure the meanest saved the longest. People on the side, blah 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 blah. Okay, nothing important. Good. You guys know that the bird is indeed. The I would say so. Bird, 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 bird. Got some berries over here. Can't find any shrooms. Yeah. Is it shrooms? Uh, is it shrooms or berries? I don't know what we need exactly. I don't know. I'm just, I'm just trying to collect everything, but you need mushrooms for the oh, uh, yes. cauldron thing. Right, right, right. There's a yoga ball. He's, he's gonna. Make. He's. They're eating anyway. They're eating anyway. I think they probably just need variety to stay happy or something. Um, yeah, I mean, we all need we all already, need a little variety. In our already life. Variety. looted that Spice house, but we need to figure out how to build walls, man. We can build walls. Yeah. Something on the roof. I'm just trying to get out. Of I can build yoga balls, wells, and beds. That's what it's telling me, but I can't yet. Huh. That's what my missions are, but I don't have any of that stuff. Tab to get curio crafting. Blunder bless shots. Hi, buddy. St. Elmo's fire. Tab for building. Golden meeper. Am I missing oh. something? I feel like I'm missing something. Oh my god, get yas. The guitar is dope. <laughs> no. Huh. And by. Uh, we got up here yet? Towards this fried rock up here, whatever it is? I'm unsure. More bone berries. Bane, I keep calling them bone berries, they're bane berries. Hmm. Oh god. I found got weed, an arrow. weed spray. Uh what was that? There was a big evil pop up up there, Watch careful. Right here. Run. Okay. 
Excuse me, real quick. Grab some berries, grab some flowers. My car! There's, we're, yeah. miss, we're missing something. There's got to be a way to upgrade to be able to build. Yo, wait. There are beds and stuff like despawn all the time? The, that that bed is a one, one night use. Ah, and okay. so is the teddy bears. But if we build the bigger beds, they can be like three, four, or five days. Okay. But I need to figure out how to unlock building. Mm -hmm. Current level one. Reach camp level four. All right. Well, build a village. Let's start by doing the things on the left, probably. I know. I don't know how to build a yep. yoga ball well in bed. I'm trying to figure that out. Uh, I don't need that. I have the curio workshop, but this just gives me aether rewards, healing solves, and apparition charms. I can't do any of the other stuff. So... I'm going to go to help messages. Camp level. Camp level is based on how much camp XP you have amassed. Camp XP comes from drakes. The older they are, the more camp XP they contribute. To raise your camp level, you must find drakes hibernating in the wilderness. Increase the age of the drakes in the village using crystals. Higher level camps allow you to build more improvements and better meet the needs of the drakes. Okay, so we need to meet up and go find some drakes. We need to go this way. It's over here. Northwest island over here. Well, we need to wait. We need aether shards first, though. We need to craft a whole bunch of those. How many do you have? How many do you have? I need to craft some. I haven't crafted any yet. I just need two each. I'd say. Not too far of a walk. I crafted there five. Uh, someone's gonna get stuck over there. Oh gosh. What do you What do you need for six? Is that the closest Drake though? There's got to be an easier it, it, one. No, it literally says on the map. Yeah, hibernating Drake circle. Okay. On so that island over that's there. That's the quest. Head to exactly. the quest. The quest, the quest, the quest, the quest. Yeah, so, I mean, someone's gonna get stuck over there with only five. We should go. Do we go to the light outfit? And then we should just cross on this beach here. Right where I'm at. The shortest way. Uh, yeah, let me come that way. Christian, come this way. Coming. Hmm. So we just need a bunch of drakes and then we need to make sure they're all happy so that way we get camp level. They'll contribute XP to the camp. Whoa! I have 15 of these things, so. Oh, wait. Oh, Jared, come back. You need to walk oh, with us. You can come with. Let's go. Let's hey, go. Let's go. With us. Heck yeah, dude. So we can save on these. Nice. That was just uh, going to say. Four seconds. Three, two, one. Ah! Ow. We're good. Dealing with Aether. Ow. What hole? It spawned. Do it again. It spawned. I dare you. It spawns a little gremlin. I... All right. Oh, there's a football. Oh, it's this a football, football boy. Football stadium. This place oh, is this evil, man. We, we gotta break, oh, these. We can break these. Yeah. So this place is real evil. Oh my God! Look at that oh, one. It's a big one. Holy beat crap! Beat us, me. Beat us, me. Whoa! Con control the dodge. Remember, dude. Mashed. Easy mash. I got some weed spray. Christian, I got middle, some middle mouse button uh, blocks too. Middle mouse button. That would've been nice to have that in the tutorial. <laughs> it was. That was the last thing I had to do. Oh, was it? Okay. Yeah. All right, well, we need to go to that circle like an MMO, which is down on the beach here. To find the Drake link. Uh, boys? What? What'd you do? Another big one, a couple oh, big ones. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my Lord. Please don't leave me. Oh, right they, have, they, have may they have like ranged attacks. Ouch. Yeah, the dogs do, yeah. Oh, Ow. okay. I'm really bad at this game so far. Fine, fine, fine. I got the, I got the range guy. Who played some baseball, boy? Ooh, chest. Purple chest. What'd you get? Schematic and a chef cleaver. There you go. Good. That chef cleaver's got to be pretty good. A cabbage okay. seed. Nice. That, 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 that grass cabbage seed? Mm -hmm. All right. The Drake Link's right down here. He's purple glowing. I mean. I'm going to dig him out of you. the ground. Come here, Oddish. Get out of the ground. Whoopee. He's purple. <gasps> He's got a flower on his head. He's so cute. His buff is food improvement efficiency. Yeah. No. Gross. But his name is Glumler, so kind of love him. Go Glumler. home, Glumler. Ooh, yeah, see, level two, we just it? got the wells. We got beds. Okay, I'm going to use another uh, thing. Stick close. Oh, God. Glumler. Oh, I don't think we're going to make it. You got to pop another one. I'll, I'll just there. pop another one. Yeah, yeah. Oh, goodness. Will it let me <laughs> pop another one? Yeah. Yeah. Hey. All right, we're good. My boot looks good in these pants. Hey, no, no, wait, Christian, wait, 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 wait. Sp hurry up! My sprinting wouldn't work. It like stopped me from sprinting. All right, all is safe. 
All right, let's go home. Right We're level there was two. A bridge now. right there, guys. <laughs> yeah, no, we just took the long route. Uh, where's our um, Where's our no base? Way. Oh, there it is. Right okay. Here. Okay, so now we could definitely build the yoga ball, the well, and the beds. So they still have their teddy bears. Oh. All right, so you need to use one of the schematics, Boomer. I'm gonna unlock the well. Oh wait, I think schematics are universal across the team. Uh, I'm gonna make the bed. Yep. Making the well. I, oh, I can do the yoga ball too. Do it up. Okay, the yoga the ball. cleansing well. Boop. Nice. So that's for fun, I'm assuming. Bed I'll put. How many, how many Draklins can sleep in a bed? Uh, I'm not sure. I can put down another one anyway. Just in case. Yeah, yeah, don't. So. Okay, so I have bed now too. Okay, 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 okay. And, uh, and all of the materials are shared. Oh, okay. Sweet. Yeah, the weapons aren't, but the materials are. Okay. How many beds did you build? Just one? I just built one, yeah. All right, I'm putting another done, one down right there. I think we need four because we have four Draklings, right? I don't know. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I Let's see in a second. Oh, no, I can't build another one. These beds are pretty big. Come on. They got to at least fit two or three in them. I mean, not, yeah, I, 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 I can... I'll, there's like, I'll, I'll there's four more. pillows. There's, every Drake needs a place to sleep. Wells provide enough water for about three young Drakes. Yoga balls have enough entertainment value for about three Drakes. All right, so we need another Yoga ball because we have four Drakes. We need another one. Uh, I need we need fabric and charms. Okay, and we need we need another bed, which we need fabric for. Yeah. No mushrooms though, man. I'm gonna stock the cauldron with what I got though. Juice boxes, and then the well is enough for three drakes as well. Wait. As well. <laughs> yuck, 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 yuck. yuck 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 yuck. Okay, so I'm trying to I'm gonna check the map. Oh, it, tell, it tells you what's, like, in the area. That's really nice. So there's actually a lot of fabric in Mill Road, which is where we were. And there's an undiscovered schematic still. Or Back a note. Road, then. Looks like a note. Back road. Yeah, let's go just gather Mill Road. Look at it. He was just bouncing on the ball. What a cutie. Just I'm, go, talk to these things kind of whenever you can, because these are how you get charms, is talking to these yeah, guys. Yeah, yeah. Charms help you craft. But I think when you do it, you the charms are universal for the team, so... True, yeah. I but if we can each talk to them, we can like triple up on the amount of charms we're getting, you know? No. Nah. Oh, yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Okay. You're so cute yeah. bouncing on the little yoga ball. Do it up, dude. Heck yeah. He's my favorite. Just coming? This one's my favorite. Glumler. You going on Mill Road? Why so glum? Yeah, we're heading over. Run in, run in, run in, run in, run in. Alrighty. Yeah, we gotta just explore pretty much that entire island. See what's up. Gather a whole bunch of things. We already found a Glumler there, so I doubt we'll find another Drakeling, but it is a really big island, so you never know. Here we go. Wait, why'd you pop it already? It was not next to you. Yet. I got a no whole bunch of them. I'm still mid max this shit. We'll find plenty. Save that now. Time you say that we never Three, two, one. We made it. We made it. There's got to be a way to like maybe fight like a mega boss on this island and like cleanse the area. Don't you think? Probably. Because like, you know how it's like all foggy and like kind of scary. Mm. I want to keep beating up these. What's it called? I assume you just break everything. There's no way you have to break all of them. That's too much. What What do you get for it? Nothing from what yeah, I could tell. Get, you get stuff. You get stuff. Yeah. Aether level goes down. It is. Yeah, you break them in the aether level. I goes found down. some you wires and some more wires. Break Wait, there's like an aether level? Oh, yeah, 14. Gotta break them. Oh, down, I, I got break. an amber shard off of that one too. I can level up a Drakeling mm -hmm. if he likes amber. It's going it's universal as well. Who's it's Amber? My guy. Alright, oh, so yeah. we just gotta get the aether level down. We just gotta it's break like ten of right them. Now. See ya. Yeeted. Hey. All right, so it's not the ones on the coast; it's the red ones. Yeah, it's the, the shiny ones. Yeah. Mm -mm -mm. Yaro. What happens when we cleanse it? Oh, look, another crystal, a moon shard. These are straight up uh, stones from Pokemon. I was just about to say that. Fire stones, moon stones. 
Oh, where's my dawn stone? Where's my dusk stone? There we go. Aether level five. Four. There's Another something. There's like a. There's yeah. like a bank truck over here. Money? Robin Bank. Supply truck. Twenty-two fabric. Collect supply trucks. Woo. To to waypoints. What? 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 What am I? To see waypoints? Oh, okay. So I unlock some waypoints in the area that show us where the next Drakeling is. That's cool. Oh, oh uh, it's like it's that so purple one. I mean, that's the closest one to where we are, I guess. You want to go to the next island? Oh, we need to get that uh, other... What's it called? There's a note over there. Yeah, I'm going for it. But did we clear the Aether? Is that it? We're good? I'm sure. I don't think so. No, I see another right It seems bright. I think we cleared enough. I see another one right here. We must be getting close. Two more. Two more. Okay. Yeah, this is a, is this a supply truck as well? Right here. Yeah. We need to find the other schematic too. Connect supply truck. Oh, to I get it. Okay, we 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 gotta knock down these trees. So I think we need to connect the supply truck to the other supply oh, truck, but yeah. there's there's a bunch of stuff blocking it. Gotta aim them at each other, yeah. Yeah, let me go down there and... Which way is it? The other one's down this way. Okay. But it's behind this building, so I don't know if that's... Can you break down the building? I may Hit be it. mistaken. No, you can't. Is it that other beam? Why is there a beam in the sky? When I right click, it does like a reload thing. All right, let me read the, uh, the info on that. Help messages. Thing, Supply trucks. Supply trucks provide a large amount of building materials, but the only way to get them is to the villages via waypoints. Build a, build plenty of waypoints, Collect, uh, connect them in a chain all the way back to your village. Once the chain is complete, supplies will start being delivered to your camp automatically. That's dope. Oh, you can always okay. use these networks to rapidly traverse the hollow. Just hop in on a line and zip over to the aether. So it's like zip lines. So, so we need to build one towards our base. We need to we need to build one in the curio workshop before we can build them here. Interesting. So you have to but build the waypoint. What's nice is we're not going to have to run around using all these crystals because we can just jump to waypoints using the zip lines. Uh huh. But we need to go back to the curio workbench and craft one first so we can once you craft them in the curio workbench you can craft them anywhere after that let's go to this other island correctly go back down what other island right i feel like we're about to get attacked no the raid i have no idea is this a new island right here oh it is okay well, let's go hug butt hug butt mm, touching touch the butts Oh god, Revere Place. Aether will spread and cut an island, disrupting supply networks if not cleared. Fully clear an island to make sure supply networks remain functional. Ow! Dude, those things are insane! This is a higher level area, man. Alright, well here's another supply truck. This one gives fabric. So we just gotta clear all the Aether level. He has a bunch of stuff though, which is... Nice. There's another yeah, truck right here. How do you tell what they give? On the back, it has like a oh, icon. Wood. So it's wood. But I was thinking we should have gone back and crafted the waypoint, so we could have at least slap the waypoint on this island as well. Um, and we're gonna head back now. Me and Christian will clear the other quick. I mean, might as well just clear it out first. on the beach. There we go. There's only five left, I think it said. Not too bad. Look around a little bit, too. I don't know if there's a Drakeling on this island. We haven't personally discovered one yet, but there Ow, might be God. one. These ones hurt. Dude, the dogs are the worst. Ow! Uh, anybody have a life potion? I'm, I'm hating it, too. Push head back. I have Great one, but there, there's a big boy down here. Yeah, we need. We should just get back. Oh my god. Go. We should just get back. There's two, oh. three big ones down there, and I'm just personally don't think we're ready for that because these are camp level four enemies. We're only level two. 
Ooh, mushrooms. Oh, nice. Good. Let's see if we find a few more of those. Add some variety to the diet. Oh, I don't know. Let's go. All right, let's, let's go. Which way is... Do you just want to go directly back to the main island? Across. Just go across. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Back to where we came. Is that that other way? This way. No, just go directly back to the, the base. We'll just... Straight back. Because once we have waypoints, hey. these we're not going to... We'll have we'll plenty of Aether Wards, but... Once we have the waypoints, we can just quick travel. Oh my god, okay. Oh gosh. Fine. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I'm just going to use my own. Ow. I'm going to die. I'm going to die. Christian, hurry up. Christian, get to us. We got to kill this thing. It's dead. All right, run, 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 run. Sprint, why don't you? I'm trying. <laughs> I'm on a sliver, by the way. Grab some Healy pets. I need to grab one of the people, one of the, one of the thingies. I'll hug a Drake. Only... Oh my God. Got him. Save me. We're good. Protect. He dead. He All dead is good. Too. All is good. What's good? Oh, sorry. I was muted. Raid timer in the top right corner. We know. Okay. I just didn't know. Ooh, a present. We know. A present. Yeah, he's got a present. He's happy. All right, see what see what crystals these guys eat. This guy eats jade crystals. I'm giving him one. Here, eat the jade the crystal. He's happier now. Wait, give me my what? The, give me the gift. What she? He likes me the best. That's why he's not giving it to you. All right, Bipling, do you do we have? We must have a moon shard for you. Nope, we don't. Give me the give me the gift, dude. He wants to give me the gift. Oh, give me I, the gift. He likes me better. Wait. Oh. Come here, Mepper. I'm trying to give these guys crystals to level them up. No, we don't have any for for, for Mepper. Giant object, a spoon. Oh, add your mushrooms. Oh, I want to do that. Here we go. And a plenty of water. All right. Epic. Put some mushrooms in me. Curio workshop. So I'm gonna craft the first waypoint. So now we can craft waypoints anywhere. Ooh, I'm gonna take this guy's buff. I think. What is it? Regenerate health while not in combat. Uh, I like the twenty percent rare drop buff personally. It's for the time being, until I so I don't have to. I'm just not gonna. Yeah, you could just switch a, heal and then switch back before we adventure. Exactly. All right, we gotta make another bed for these guys. Two more, actually, right? Oh, we don't have any fabric. No, we need waypoints to connect them. Oofers. We got plenty of food, water, and entertainment for now, so that's good. We should be good. We should be good. Thank you guys for stopping by today's episode. Remember to join the giveaway down below. Giving away at least one copy. And uh, hopefully you guys enjoy it, and I'll see you tomorrow with the next episode. Be sure to subscribe, turn on the notification icon, be notified whenever the next Drake Hollow video does go live. And uh, we'll see you in the next one. Peace out.